for this uh, specific image, for example, if we want to correct some uh, errors in the auto detection, for example, this volume, you can see actually this branch should should be from this uh, dendrite, not from this dendrite, but due to the maybe the intensity distribution or due to the z-resolution, uh, our algorithm failed to trace from here. So now we need to manually uh, correct this error. First, we need to delete the existing ones. So we can go to uh, edit tab and we can select these ones we want to delete and just click delete. Okay, so we can delete all. For here, I want to delete not only the, the dendrite, but also the spines. So here we can, I can select the branch. So I can select everything easily and then click delete. As well as this one, I can delete. Okay. So I have deleted the, the false result. So now I need to do some uh, tracing from here to here. So to, to do this uh, correction of the result after the automatic uh, detection, we can do use some uh, semi-automatic tracing. So first we need to select this structure, this branch where we want to start another branch. Then we can go to the draw tab and here we use the auto pass algorithm and set selection as starting point so now once you change your mouse to select mode and the move mouse pointer along with this to the end of this uh, uh, branch you will see this automatic uh, tracing result starting from this point so by doing this, you can retrace this structure and use mouse scroll to zoom in or zoom out uh, to, to uh, increase or decrease the size, the diameter. So here the size you should uh, match the, the end of this dendrite size to be able to, for Imaris to calculate the correct uh, diameter. So this is maybe too big and this is too small. So maybe just to fit this size. But we can also recalculate this after we do this manual tracing. So here to finish, just hold the shift and left click to finish this manual tracing. So now new dendrite branch uh, is complete. Okay. And if you want to you know, re retrace this spine as well. There are two ways. First way is also you can manually trace these spines. So in the time this uh, branch is still highlighted, it means it's selected, you can set selection as starting point again and the change from the dendrite to spines. So now you can manually draw these uh, spines as well holding the shift, left click, shift, left click, shift, left click, shift, left click. So they will do. Another way is to ask Imaris to recalculate using this uh, creation tab. So go to creation and click keep data and do this uh, spice. So in, by checking this keep data, all the existing ones will be kept and according to these numbers, Imaris will try to recalculate these spines. So let me just show you. Okay, so here you can see we have some spine detected but uh, maybe because of these numbers, so this detection, so maybe there are some, okay, I think this one is correct. And maybe this one is also correct. So that should be okay. 
Yep. So as you can see, Maris will re-detect the spice uh, on all the images by using the existing uh, dendrites. So just remember to check on that check uh, keep data. So this dendrite you uh, manually trace will also be used to on on this uh, spine uh, detection automatic spine detection as well. Okay, like this. Right, so that is uh, the way to uh, correct the, the uh, automatic uh, trace result. So for this, for this uh, menu, uh, semi-automatic trace uh, dendrites, there is one important function under the edit tab. After you manually trace this result, you can always you know, select this one and go to the bottom top here, try to recenter and then redo the diameter of this uh, dendrites or multiple dendrites you manually traced. So here you can recenter this dendrite to make this tracing more center to the uh, standing structure. And then after that, if you are not satisfied with the uh, current uh, diameters, you can just go to go to the slice view and try to really look into this thin structure and give the diameter 0 0.3. So 0 0.3 and based on this diameter, you can recalculate. Okay, recalculate this diameter again. So it will give you a more, maybe the more accurate result. Okay, so that is a uh, uh, auto, auto pass algorithm. And these are some different ways to make the selection. So you can try to look, but basically this is for using some numbers to, as a reference to select these uh, dendrites. Okay, 